of the economy. How would you get the employment up and the wages up and everything like that? Do you have a strategy? Is there something you would do? Well, I certainly would. I mean, there are a lot of strategies, but if you look at what's going on with China and other countries, they're making our product. They're doing everything. They're making what we sell. They're making a lot of things. Now they're going to start their own airplane companies to compete with Boeing. Uh, we send our cars. We send everything over there. They take them. And by the way, these companies are signing agreements that they have to give away their technology to China. Otherwise, you can't do business in China. Uh, China charges, charges taxes to these companies that do business in China. So we have to get back to China. And it's not only China. It's China and other countries. It's also OPEC. If you look at what's going on, there's so much oil, there's so much energy around, and yet it doesn't go down. It's setting up new records, and it's setting new records. OPEC is laughing at us how stupid we are, Bill, how stupid we are. So you have to attack China and other countries economically. You have to go back to making product. Our real unemployment number is much higher than the 7.5%. They have 7.5. It's probably 17 or 18 yeah, percent. people have stopped because looking for work. Okay. Yeah, and that's what I pretty much said in my talking that's not in memo. The weak economy here and, and the huge debt is, is, is taking, robbing our power. But when you say you're going to attack China, that means you're going to get into a trade war with them. And that could very, very severely affect the American economy, could it not? Bill, we have all the power. Believe me, you know, it's uh, one of those things. Uh, they supposedly lend us money. What are they doing? They're lending us our money. If China ever thought that we were going to tax their product coming into this country, which stupidly we don't, if they ever thought there was somebody that really was going to do it, they would stop manipulating their currency, which is the biggest thing they have on us. Not cheap labor. They manipulate brilliantly, better than anybody has ever manipulated before their currency. And if they'd stop doing that, right. we would be able to compete just, with China in terms of... And just let me dumb they it don't down. believe that just, we're serious. Let me dumb it down. When they manipulate their currency, that means they get more dollars and we get less dollars because their money's not worth anything That's right. in the open market. All right, now, and another uh, subject here. a lot more to manufacture our goods. Right.